when Liverpool completed the signing of Calvin Ramsey relatively promptly in the transfer window, it appeared to signal an intention to rectify the few remaining obvious weak points in the squad. Back up for Trent Alexander-Arnold was one of just two clear holes, but as the summer ticks on, it seems more and more likely that the other one will remain unfilled. The Jurgen Klopp can justifiably point out that his team just came closer than any side has done before the historic quadruple. His impatient defense of the existing midfield options has a lot of merit. But it is impossible to deny that Liverpool currently lacks specialist cover to Fabinho in the number 6 role. Whether such a player is needed is up for legitimate debate. Club and FSG clearly think not. Calculating that they can get by with Jordan Henderson and James Miller as makeshift stand-ins, the precision performance of Steven Budge-Setic may well have strengthened their resolve. And it is not as though there are a queue of excellent players desperate to become a backup option, with Fabina firmly embedded as the first choice. Even so, it would be churlish to ignore the fact that Liverpool are somewhat rolling the dice, notwithstanding the fact that Henderson and Milner are more advanced players by trade. The pair are 32 and 36 respectively, their own availability is likely to decline, and neither can be considered massively long-term options. Meanwhile, Fabino himself has been subject to a massive game load in his career to date, and the injuries have slowly started to stack up. It's why Liverpool will be keeping a close eye on transfer business at West Ham United. While they may be planning to get by on a wing and a prayer for one more season, next summer will surely be the time for action. And if the latest potential addition at the bowling ground impresses, he could be firmly on the radar. Amado Onana is already liked at Liverpool. The Athletic recently reported that he is admired by Anfield officials, but now it appears he could be off to West Ham, with Sky Sports reporting that Lille have accepted 33.5 million porcelain bid for the defensive midfielder. The two parties are reportedly still not close on personal terms, so Liverpool could theoretically jump in. But it may be that they are secretly pleased with the prospect of him moving elsewhere in the Premier League first. Fabino, of course, was plucked straight from the French Ligi, and that worked out very well indeed. However, he did have a long adaptation period, with club waiting months before he was satisfied that the Brazilian was ready to start. With the 28-year-old now entrenched as a starter, Onana would face even longer on the sidelines before getting regular minutes. But by this time next year, Fabino will be less than three months from his 30th birthday. The issue of cover, and indeed of long-term succession, will be increasingly hard to ignore. Enter Onana, who by this stage could have a season of Premier League experience under his belt.